The Bible is God's holy word. It's made up of 66 books and divided into two parts. The first part is the Old Testament, and the second is the New Testament. The Old Testament has 39 books. Let's sing them. Let us sing the books of Moses, of Moses, of Moses. Let us sing the books of Moses, for he wrote the law. First Genesis, then Exodus, then Leviticus, then Numbers, then the book of Deuteronomy, the last of them all. Joshua, Judges, Ruth, first and second Samuel, first and second Kings, first and second Chronicles, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther are the books of history. These are the books of poetry, they are five in number, Job, Psalms, Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song of Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, and Daniel are the major prophets. Hosea, Joel, Amos, Obadiah, Jonah, Micah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Zechariah, Malachi, these are the minor prophets. The New Testament has 27 books. Let us sing the four Gospels, the Gospels, the Gospels. Let us sing the four Gospels, for they tell of the Christ. First Matthew, then Mark, then Luke and John. The birth, life, and death of Jesus and ascension. The growth of the church and work of the Spirit, how we should worship, what we should practice. The growth of the church and work of the Spirit in the book of Acts. Romans, 1st and 2nd Corinthians, Galatians, Ephesians, Philippians, Colossians, 1st and 2nd Thessalonians, 1st and 2nd Timothy, Titus, Philemon, Hebrews, James, 1st and 2nd Peter, 1st and 2nd and 3rd John, and Jude are the letters to the church. In the book of Revelation, it tells us many things. It tells us of the rapture of the church and the great tribulation with Satan, the return of Christ for a thousand years and the everlasting fire for the wicked, but everlasting life for all who believe.